let me tell you about the absolute worst morning that I've had in a very long time. The power went out shortly after I went to sleep, and when I woke up, I found every device I needed basically a brick. Now I need to figure out a way to charge my devices before I have to go to work. And that's when I realized this was the perfect time to test Anchor's new flagship Prime lineup. This is the industry-leading 300-watt multi-port fast charging power bank, and it's become the hero of my day. One power source, three dead devices, let's see what happens. This thing is pumping out nearly 160 watts of fast charging. And here's the crazy part. A single port can hit 140 watts, full speed laptop charging from a power bank. And then disaster round two, the power bank hit zero. The prime power bank can recharge to 50% in 13 minutes using dual USB-C inputs. Look, 140 watts in, and plugging in a second cable can boost the charging speeds up to 250 watts. Those are the fastest charging speeds that I've seen from a power bank yet. I wasn't even done making coffee and it was already halfway charged. And after 13 minutes, the generic power bank wasn't even close to being at 50%. It's the size of my phone, weighs like three of them, and it's TSA approved. This thing is basically a personal power station. But here's where the story gets even better. This tiny thing, the world's most compact 160 watt multi-port charger, replaced every charger on my desk. Three devices charging at full speed thanks to GAN Prime 2.0 and PowerIQ 5.0. It's basically like using three original Apple chargers, except it's the same size as AirPods Pro. And when I plug into a single port, boom, 140 watts, no guessing, no drop-offs, the screen tells you exactly what's going on. Both the power bank and the wall adapter are equipped with AnchorSense technology. This is a built-in smart display that gives you real-time data, temperature, charging mode, battery info, all right there on the screen. With the app, I can customize port power, change screen savers, monitor temps, and make everything behave exactly the way I want. My entire setup went from dead to fully working faster than with wired chargers alone. And between the 160 watt charger and the 300 watt power bank, I honestly didn't expect the Prime series to be in this good. Now get ready because this is where things get wild. Because we're about to talk about wireless charging that's faster than you think is even possible. Every night, this is what I deal with. Cables everywhere, multiple chargers, and my phone heating up while charging. Wireless charging has always been convenient, but it's always been slow, hot, and honestly, kind of pointless if you need to fast charge. Until now. This is the world's first 25 watt wireless charger with active cooling and a built-in display. And for the first time, wireless is actually fast. This charges an iPhone 17 Pro Max to 40% in only 22 minutes. That's faster than using Apple's 20 watt wired charger and it's gonna keep your phone much cooler. And compared to the old five watt chargers, you might as well just let it charge overnight. Here's the secret. Aerospace grade tech cooling. This is the kind of technology used in satellites, but now it's cooling your phone on your nightstand. With tech cooling and Active Shield 5.0 checking the temperatures 10 million times a day, your phone will stay much cooler than using any other wireless charger on the market today. There's no throttling, no heat spikes, and it's battery safe. This is the first wireless charger that I would trust to keep my phone's battery healthy long term. And just like with the power bank and the wall adapter, the wireless charger is equipped with anchor sense. It allows you to see your charging information right there on the built-in screen, change your settings, monitor temperatures, and it's super easy to connect to the app, a few presses of a button, and you get real-time temperature, charging status, and icons for every device, phone, watch, and AirPods. This feels like a wireless charger from the future. Everything stays current with over-the-air updates instantly. It also has three different modes to suit your usage. In boost mode, the tech cooling starts immediately. This is for fast daytime charging. And here's what the fan sounds like in this mode. In ice mode, cooling goes full throttle, perfect for streaming shows, long video call sessions, or anything battery intensive. Your phone stays cold the entire time. And here's what the fan sounds like in this mode. 
But what about nighttime? Tap sleep mode and everything turns off. No noise, no lights, just silent charging. And of course, it charges your iPhone, Apple Watch, and AirPods all at the same time. One cable for a perfectly clean setup. It also feels and looks premium. It's not cheap or plasticky, and it actually elevates my room instead of adding clutter. It also has a really nice soft touch silicone for your AirPods and iPhone charging to help keep your phone scratch free. It's got a really good weight to it, and that chrome metal makes it look really nice. After testing this, I can say it. Wireless charging has finally arrived. Fast, cool, quiet, and smart. This is the charger that replaces my entire nightstand setup. In the beginning of the video, the Anchor Prime power adapter and wall charger showed you just how raw and powerful charging can be. And as far as aesthetics and good looks, this wireless charging can show you how elegant charging can be as well. And here's a little bonus for this video, the Anchor Prime car charger. Now, I unfortunately don't have a car that's compatible with this wireless charger, but I can at least show you and tell you everything about it. This is compatible with pretty much any iPhone that uses MagSafe, or if you have another phone that has a MagSafe compatible case, you can also use it with this wireless charger as well. This, of course, is using the Qi Wireless 2 standard, and it can do up to 25 watts charging. It also has active cooling, just like the wireless charger for your house, so it's going to keep your phone nice and cool while it's charging, especially if this is going to be in direct sunlight in your car. So let's see what you get inside the box here. So here we have our car charger. We've got a USB Type-C that can output up to 45 watts and a USB-A that can output up to 12 watts. And here is the charger itself. It's got some pretty good weight to it. It also has a nice soft touch silicone to help keep your phone in place and to help keep your phone nice and scratch free. You can see the fan blade, kind of the fan vents right there. You can also Release this from your air vent with this nice big rotating piece here. You can see it kind of moving in and out. Now this works pretty much with all the blade air vents. So you need to make sure that your car's air vents are compatible with this before you buy it. I have a Tesla, so I'm not able to use this charger. Another thing is, is you can't really take this off and use it with any other mount. It's pretty much... Uh, stuck on there pretty good and there's also no way to tighten this up it's just as tight as it's going to be for moving your phone around and then for the other accessories you also get this really nice usb type c to usb type c cable that has these little grips on here so you can kind of cable manage your cable so it's not hanging all over your car so I'll plug this into our charger we'll plug this into the bottom here And it's also got this really nice soft blue go glow, which is really nice. And then once you have it all plugged in, just simply take your phone, put it on your charger. It will work and charge through a case if you have one. And it's also held on there pretty good. I definitely don't think your phone is going to just fall off your, your accessory while it's in your car. And the little ball hinge here is also held in place really well. So you don't have to worry about your phone just like sagging down or anything like that. It's on there pretty good. You can also use your phone in a landscape mode as well if you need to use your maps or stream a, a video or something like that while you're, you know, taking a break in your car. It also has a fan that starts immediately to help keep your phone nice and cool. I can really feel the breeze coming off the charger and it's also super quiet so if you're taking a nap or something like that in your car you don't have to worry about hearing that fan cooling off your phone i also really love the fact that this piece here for tightening is oversized it just makes it a lot easier to kind of clamp down on your air vents and once you take your phone off the charger the little fan inside stops running Something like this would be absolutely amazing to use in states where it gets super hot outside Typically, when you have an air vent charger, it's going to be on an air vent where it's going to be in direct sunlight. And if you've used wireless charger before, you'll know that when it's charging your phone, it gets super hot. Well, that's where that tech chip comes into play. And it's going to keep your phone nice and cool while charging, even if it's going to be in direct sunlight. Now, I had an absolute blast testing out Anchor's Prime Series chargers. And 
I honestly believe that these are some of the best chargers that you can buy right now. I do also want to let you know that Anchor did send these out to me just so I could make this video, but I'm not being paid at all for this review. I'm also interested to know what you guys think about the Anchor Prime series and if you've had any experience with them yet. If so, let me know in the comments below. And if you guys want to pick any of these up yourself, I will be putting product links in the video description. And if you guys enjoyed the video, please let me know by hitting the like button and consider subscribing. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you have a great day and I'll see you in the next one.